today I'm going to be doing a what's in my car or a car tour video. I'm filming this on my phone just because it was like a lot easier than my big camera because it doesn't focus as easily. So if the quality is like a little different, then that is why, but don't worry, this will be like the only video that I film on my phone. But basically I wanted to just do this quick little intro to say that I'm not bragging in any way, shape or form. I thought this would just be a really fun video to do because I have gotten a lot of questions on like what's in my car. Cause when I, like before I got a car, I would, constantly watch what's in my car videos. I watched so many just because I was so interested and I was so excited to get my own car. So a few like disclaimers about it. Um, I put in a thousand dollars of my own money towards the car and I'm very grateful that I had to put in money um, towards it because that just like teaches you the value of money and teaches you that not everything is handed to you. Not that if, if you didn't have to pay for a car, good for you. But um, like, I'm not saying that that's bad or good or anything, but um, I'm just glad that I had to just so that I could like know that I put a lot of like hard work into getting it. So yeah, and I also have to pay for all my gas and everything and if anything ever goes wrong with the car, like any mechanical issues, I also have to pay for that. But again, that just teaches you the value of money and I'm really grateful that I have to do that. And also um, I had to wait, I got this car about a year ago, like 10 months ago, last July I got it. I had to wait six months, um, at least six months to get my car because that's just a rule in our family. My sister had to wait six months, so I had to wait six months because I think that just like teaches you that once you're 16, doesn't mean you like just get, get just get a car treat like that. I can't talk today, I don't know why, but basically it um, teaches you this lighting, I'm sorry. Basically it just teaches you that once you turn 16 does not mean you get a car right off the bat. Um, my parents were very big on that. They did not want me to think that just because I was turning 16 means I get a car or anything. So I was very grateful for that. As hard as it was to wait, I am so grateful that I did because it made that moment that much more special to be able to get a car. Um, so yes, those are just a few things about my car and it is a 2002 or 2003 Volkswagen Beetle. It is yellow and it's just my baby. I absolutely adore it. I just love it. Every time I see it, I smile and I just love it. It's just such a happy car and whenever people see me, they like take pictures of my car or like, it's just really cute. I love it. I love seeing people's smiles when they see my car and I smile when I see my car. So it's just great. Hope you all enjoy this video and please subscribe. It means so much to me and let's just get right on into the video. So if you go around, you'll see that I have a monogram up here and I have my own monogramming business so that is there it is just a white monogram I believe it's five inches or maybe six inches it might be six inches and then I just have a lighthouse retreat magnet if you don't know what lighthouse is maybe I'll do like a video on it but basically it's a mission trip where you go down and serve families that have children with cancer so that is an organization and a place that is very near and dear to my heart so I have a little magnet on the back of it and yeah so this is the back and then you just go on there's the gas go on and you can see inside the car that's um it's like not tinted at all or anything and then this is the front so let's go on in so these are my keys i have a little pink key cover which i got from ebay so this is just like the standard volkswagen key you can put it down let's see if i can do this with one hand you can put it down oh goodness well well you know you basically just like flip it up but it's never really down because I just don't feel the need to put it down, but this is it. And again, I got the key cover from eBay and then I have the wrist strap for my wallet. And then I have a natural life keychain, which is this elephant and it says, be happy. I think that's really cute. And then I just have this Michael Kors brown studded wallet. So if you lock it, I really love the sound it makes when it locks. I just think it's really cute. And then you can unlock it and let's go on in. When you open up the car, the interior is like also yellow, so it's like yellow over there in the back and right here. So I love that because it just like brings on the happiness into the inside of the car. So yeah, it's yellow on the side and then it just has gray kind of interior and then some black. So like as you'll notice like on the sides it has black like this part, but then it's gray. So yes, and also it is a 2002, so it's about 14 years old, but I love it. It works amazing, and yeah, I, I just, I love this car. It's done me so well, and it's perfect because it's yellow, and it's just really fun. On the side here, I just have the trunk and then the gas um, little buttons, and then I have a black umbrella and then a Victoria's Secret like coconut body mist, which smells so amazing, and then I just have the window control and the mirror control. 
and the lock and unlock and everything and the window and then you go on in and you just have like all the standard stuff so like the lights and everything and then this is my steering wheel cover I got it from a shop on Etsy I'll try to find it and link it down below but I loved it because it had like a little bit of yellow in it so it kind of matched with my car but it also brought a little a bit of like different colors to it so I really love it um, and also like it keeps my steering wheel from being too hot or cold so I love that and then my seats are just again like the gray so I'll go ahead and sit down first thing everyone says when they get into my car is like how long the dashboard is and I know it's like literally crazy but I don't know I, I like it I should I feel like I should like put something right there but for now it's just empty but up here I have got my mirror and then I've got one of these natural life things that says I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me it's like an air freshener and I have some extras over there and then I have the time and the temperature up here so it's 302 and then it's apparently 68 degrees outside then up here I have my garage opener and then I've got this little thing from Bath and Body Works it's so so cute it's basically just like the air fresheners and it is like this little cup and when I bought it um I was like mom is this like inappropriate or something because I don't want it to seem like it is but like it's it's just a cute little like cocktail thing not that I drink cocktails or anything but I just thought it was really cute it can be maybe like just like a a virgin strawberry daiquiri but um I thought it was really cute and it matched like the yellow lemon match with my car and then it brought again the pink into it so I thought it was super cute I don't know which scent I have currently in here but I do have some backups in my center console but this just goes right here and makes my car smell very nice so then right here I have the sunroof controller so let's go ahead and turn on the car and I will open it so to open it you just dot turn the dial that way Oh, yes. Moving over here, I've just got the radio and everything, and this radio, like, came with the car when I bought it, but obviously it's not, like, the same radio that was um, originally in the car, but I love it because it has the aux cord and everything, and then normally I just listen to the regular radio, but I do have an aux cord here just in case I want to listen to something else, and then... Over here, I've just got like the temperature controls, so the temperature and how high it's going and everything, and then where you want it to go. So it can, I love this because it can like go on your feet or your feet and your like face, or like you can just change it. So I like that. And then I've just got like the regular controls here, and then I've got seat heaters, which is amazing. It helps me so much in the winter because it gets really cold, and then I can just heat my seats, and it, they heat up really fast and really warm. So I love that. And then over here, I've got the little charger so I've got a charger plugged in and um it's just for my phone so that's back there or you can do it like under here but um yeah so that's there and then I have a car cup of gum because I'm obsessed with gum but the thing I love about this car is like your cup holder can move so it can either be under here or out here so like if I have bigger cups it can go right here and then moving on to right here um I just have my bag my bag's always just like thrown right here and over here is just the door and then I don't have anything in there but over here I've got the little drawer thingy majigger and right here I just have like a Ray-Bans case I don't have any Ray-Bans in there because they're my center console but then I have this like pouch and it is full of change so if I'm ever going through a drive through I can just like you know Take this change out and I'm I need to like go turn this into like cash instead so that I can just like have dollars but then over here I've got a little pouch that is full of just like random stuff so I've got a Laura Mercier powder a EOS lip balm and then a lotion and then I just have some backup of those air fresheners the natural life ones that hang on my mirror and then I've just got like paperwork and everything and some pens and pencils in here. Moving on to the center console, basically just open it like this. And I've got um, my Ray-Bans in here and then I've got a little remote thingy. Um, this is like for the radio, but I've never ever used it. And then I've got a MAC powder and then a Maybelline powder. And then I've got a hand sanitizer. It is the Vanilla Berry Sorbet hand sanitizer. And then I've got two of these little um, scent portable things. Oh, this one doesn't... Maybe I used this one already. But I have leaves. Um, and then I don't know what scent is in the one right now, but um, I think it's like the the fresh linen or something. But I need to get some more like summery scents because that is a fall scent. But that is all that is in there. Back here, two back seats nothing literally nothing I don't 
yeah, there's nothing here. The actual funny thing about this car though is that the lock and unlock button is actually the window button because there must be like a glitch in the um, like like wires. So that is the window button and this locks and unlocks the car. So that's nice. But yeah, I just thought that was funny. I figured that out one day when my friend was like, how do I unlock and unlock your, or how do I like put the window down? And then one day I was in my car alone and I um, tried to do it and I was like, what in the world? They're switched. So I think that's pretty funny. That is all that I should really show. That's kind of it in the inside. And now I will show the trunk. So to open the trunk, you either press this or you hold down the trunk button that is on the key. But that just opens the trunk and you just lift it up and I literally have oh I, another thing I like about this car is that it goes like directly through it's not just like a really little trunk like the convertibles I know like don't have like the open hatchback um but the thing I love about this is that if it's raining this literally covers me like if I'm ever in the school parking lot I can just like stand right under it and I don't get wet so it's very nice but there's literally nothing in my trunk except for this bag oh also what I like about it is that it has that thing so I can like set things on it if I have a drink and I'm getting my backpack out I can just put it right here Nine times out of ten it won't spill, but I did have a situation where my drink spilt and it went that way So it spilled all over my back seat, but it's okay. You gotta live and learn from your mistakes But I basically just have this bag and it can act as like a shopping tote Maybe if I'm going to the grocery store or something, but I just have a first aid kit and a bottle of water um, That's not a bug. I don't know what that is though. It's like a fuzz, but uh, Yeah, I just have a standard first aid kit You never know if you're gonna need a band-aid or something and then a bottle of water You never know if you're gonna be thirsty. So I have it in this and then it's just like a market tote so if I ever need a market tote then I've got myself covered but that just like stays right here and then I have nothing else in here unless my backpack is in here but other than that nothing else is in here so that is it for my car tour I really hope y'all enjoyed and comment below other video suggestions and yeah I hope you enjoyed this video and maybe it will inspire you to get a bright yellow bug. Thank you all so much for watching and please subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye!